Can you picture the world of the 1940s? Quite a leap from that era to the present day, right? It's incredible how much our world has advanced in terms of science, technology, politics, healthcare, and cosmic discoveries since then. Now, let's shift our gaze to the future, peering ahead 80 years from today. While we can make informed guesses based on current trends and ongoing projects, history has shown that unforeseen events can drastically reshape our future, defying earlier expectations. In today's video, let's dive into the possibilities for the year 2100. Nuclear War Human history, a roller coaster of wars and their aftermaths. Wars, it seems, have defined our past. Fortunately, in recent memory, the world as we know it has been free from large-scale wars for some time. Sure, there have been localized conflicts, such as the Iraq War, but we've been living in relatively peaceful times. But that doesn't mean we should be relaxed about it. After all, there are a lot of political figures out there in the world right now that aren't exactly the most kind or stable people mentally. That's not to say they'll slam the fire button on their arsenals, but it is a probability, and the thing they would fire is nuclear missiles. Now, on the one hand, the world's stockpile of nuclear missiles is actually smaller than you might have thought. Back in the days of the Cold War, nations were amassing these destructive weapons as if there was no tomorrow, fueled by the constant fear of an impending war. However, those intense days have faded into history. But don't be mistaken, we still possess a considerable number of these world-altering devices. History has taught us a critical lesson. All it takes is one wrong move, one misunderstanding, one misstep, and we could find ourselves plunged into the horrors of war. With tensions remaining high and the uncertainty of future events looming over the next seven decades, it's hard not to entertain the idea that a catastrophic nuclear conflict might be a possibility we can't ignore. Landing on Mars Alright, let's switch gears and dive into something truly exciting. A project that's currently making waves across the globe, led by prominent entities like NASA and SpaceX. The big idea here? we're setting our sights on none other than Mars. For as long as humanity has looked up at the night sky, the dream of having not just one home on Earth, but also on distant planets, has burned brightly within us. NASA in particular has been on a mission to explore the cosmos, searching for places where we might one day set up camp. They've found some promising leads, but the vast distances involved make it a bit tricky. So for now, our best bet is to find a place that's relatively close to us and where we can establish a colony with some degree of ease. Enter Mars. Now, let's be crystal clear. Turning Mars into a livable colony won't be a walk in the park. The blueprint for this grand endeavor isn't fully fleshed out just yet. In fact, up until now, no human missions have made the journey to Mars. But that's about to change. Both NASA and SpaceX, a private company led by the visionary Elon Musk, have their own ambitious plans to make Mars our second home. It's like a new age space race to see who can pull it off first. As things stand, it looks like Elon Musk's team might be the first to touch down on Martian soil in 2024, depending on various factors. But regardless of who wins this celestial sprint, by 2100, we won't just have set foot on Mars will likely have established multiple bustling Martian cities. This opens up a universe of possibilities for humanity as we become dual world dwellers, expanding the horizons of colonization in ways we've only dreamed of. Remember that famous phrase, to boldly go where no man has gone before? Well, it's becoming our reality. Technology Boom Throughout history, Humanity's identity has often been shaped by the technology of its time. Once upon a time, the bow and arrow reigned supreme as the world's ultimate weapon. Then came gunpowder, followed by tanks, missiles, cyber hacking, and the list goes on. But hold on, it's not just weaponry that defines us. Technology seeps into every aspect of our lives, from how we build towering skyscrapers to crafting faster, smarter computers. Whether we realize it or not, 
technology wields tremendous power over our daily existence. The big question, where will we stand in 2100? Frankly, it's a bit of a mystery. Sure, we can make informed guesses based on our current trajectory and the ambitious projects brewing in various corners of the world. Yet history loves to throw curveballs. Sometimes a single event or a mere year can revolutionize everything so dramatically that looking back just a few years earlier would make you chuckle. We call this phenomenon a technology boom. Think about it. There were pivotal moments in history, like the birth of personal computers and the tiny but mighty microchip, the advent of radar, x-rays, microwaves, and the arrival of groundbreaking medicines. Now zip ahead to 2100 and you might find cars that run without a drop of fossil fuel. Imagine homes powered entirely by the sun, medicine capable of curing diseases that seem incurable today, wearable computers controlled effortlessly by voice, complete with holographic projectors, and yes, even food replicators. The possibilities in this case are limitless. The only question is what the event itself will be that inspires or sparks the next boom, and when it will happen. But you'd be foolish to say that it won't happen before 2100, because humanity doesn't like staying stagnant. Of course, there's a flip side to all this rapid advancement, a cautionary tale to heed. But that's a story for another time. Technological Singularity? For those unfamiliar with the term, let's dive into the concept of technological singularity, a phrase that paints a picture of a future where technological advancement reaches a point of no return, thrusting our world into unimaginable change. Now, there are two intriguing angles to consider here. One scenario envisions a world where our dependence on technology grows so immense that we're forever intertwined with it, unable to revert to a simpler era. The other, more science fiction-esque notion suggests that we might create artificial intelligence, AI, so advanced and potent that it takes the reins of control leaving us in the back seat. Neither of these options seems particularly enticing, and if we're honest, we're standing at the precipice of something resembling these scenarios right now. Humanity's reliance on technology deepens with each passing year, and you needn't look far to see it. Just glance at the younger generation. A mere decade ago, you'd spot a couple of kids out of ten clutching cell phones. Today, in most first world countries, it's a staggering nine out of ten. Are these devices truly necessities for the young ones? Well, that's up for debate, and many would argue they're not. Also, humanity is working with various forms of AI right now that are getting more and more advanced. You might even have one in your home right now, via Siri or Alexa. Beyond these, there are more advanced AIs in development, some of which are being integrated into autonomous robots, capable of performing tasks like opening doors for their robotic comrades. It's both fascinating and, yes, a tad unsettling. So, as we fast forward to 2100, there's a palpable and somewhat disconcerting prospect that we'll have plunged headfirst into the abyss of technological singularity. Now, it's not an absolute inevitability, mind you, but it's highly probable that we'll be treading these waters in some form by that juncture. The burning question that lingers is how we, as a society, will adapt to this newfound way of life. Cosmic Events Alright, don't just focus solely on the advancements humanity may bring to the table by 2100. You must remember that our planet exists within a vast cosmos, teeming with phenomena that often escape our daily attention. Fortunately, there are dedicated individuals who continually cast their gaze towards the stars, and as we peer into the future, we discover a host of cosmic events awaiting us. Among these celestial occurrences, some promise to be not just fine, but downright exhilarating. Take for instance the return of Halley's Comet, expected around 2061. If you happen to be around then, mark it on your calendar, as it's destined to provide a truly awe-inspiring spectacle. Yet amid the cosmic carnival, there are also more ominous events lurking on the horizon. One such concern is an asteroid scheduled to pass close to Earth in 2050. While current predictions suggest it won't collide with our planet, it's crucial to recognize that we're still three decades away from this cosmic encounter. 
the universe is renowned for its unpredictability and trajectories can shift. It might seem grim, but history reminds us that Earth has narrowly escaped asteroid calamities, not just the infamous dinosaur killer, but other near misses that nearly spelled planetary catastrophe. For those seeking a brighter cosmic outlook by 2100, there's an array of positive celestial events to anticipate. The universe will bestow upon us the birth of supernovas, mesmerizing meteor showers, the emergence and demise of planets, and countless other cosmic phenomena over the next seven decades, each a captivating chapter in humanity's cosmic chronicle. Moreover, if our aspirations to reach Mars bear fruit, we'll gain an additional vantage point from which to explore the universe. This Martian perspective may unveil celestial wonders that remain hidden from our terrestrial view, offering us fresh insights into the mysteries of the cosmos. Medicine and Disease There was a time in our human story when life was an incredibly fragile thing. In fact, places like ancient Rome witnessed more teenagers succumbing to untimely deaths than not, largely because medical science hadn't yet evolved to the point where it could save them. But fear not, we've journeyed far from those perilous days, and the horizon gleams with the promise of even more powerful medicine to extend our lifespans. We've touched upon this during our discussion of the technology boom, but it's crucial to delve deeper into the medical breakthroughs that could potentially propel us toward near immortality. Far from the realm of science fiction, this is a genuine aspiration within the realm of humanity and medicine. As a species, we've already pioneered various pills and nutrients designed to fortify our bodies and prolong our vitality. So, the prospect of a future innovation bolstering our immune systems to superhero levels, rendering us impervious to diseases, isn't just possible, it's highly probable. However, here's the flip side of the coin. Just as we harness the power to create medicines that enhance our lives, we also possess the knowledge and technology to engineer viruses or biological weapons capable of catastrophic destruction. It's almost happened before, and those were via natural things like the Black Plague or AIDS or the avian flu. With those as a reference, countries could make biological weapons and decimate a country. With 70 years until 2100, a biological attack is very probable especially since every major nation in the whole world has the capabilities to make these things work and happen. And man-made biological attacks have already happened on the Earth, just in a small scale. But by 2100, it'd be hard-pressed to believe that a large-scale event won't happen. Aliens? Within the vast cosmos, mysteries abound, but none hold the enduring allure of the question, do aliens exist? Many have pondered, many have searched, and many have made theories or statements claiming that aliens have already been to Earth. But as a whole, humanity remains in the dark regarding the existence of extraterrestrial beings. But maybe the reason we haven't seen them yet is they haven't had the time to get here. After all, space is big, and despite all the predictions of aliens with light speed capabilities and such, we don't know how fast they can go. But maybe in the next 70 years, we'll have contact with them. Maybe in the next several decades, we'll receive a signal that is clearly not from any random object in space. Perhaps by 2100, we'll have a true close encounter of the third kind. Or maybe we won't, and we'll still be wondering where the heck these aliens are. It's hard to say. World peace? Ah, the dream of many people on the planet. The dream of coming together not as a group of nations, but as one planet to make things better. In the midst of today's complex political landscape, achieving such unity may seem like an insurmountable challenge. With world leaders often at odds, filled with distrust or outright hostility, the idea of global harmony can appear remote. But by 2100, the world may be a very different place. We've seen the world come together to help change things, like with the Live Aid concert, or the events of 9-11, or certain other things. But imagine if an event, whatever it may be, rose up and created such a unifying force that the world itself changed for the better. This might seem like the stuff of science fiction, akin to the vision of Earth becoming a harmonious, near-perfect planet, as depicted in Star Trek, achieved through advanced technology and global unification. But here's the intriguing part. 
this dream could become a reality on Earth. Surprisingly, it might not be as challenging as it initially appears. The key lies in a singular, transformative event that binds us all together. It could be a response to a devastating conflict, a global health crisis that affects a substantial portion of the planet, or perhaps a breakthrough technology that dismantles the barriers dividing nations, revealing the futility of hostility. With ample time stretching between the present and 2100, the possibilities are vast. Who's to say that Earth won't evolve into a genuinely peaceful planet by that time? A place where global unity and cooperation shine as guiding beacons for a brighter tomorrow.